Aaron, as dominant as Dellen has been this season, when that ninth inning unfolds the way that it does, is there a level of not only disappointment, but you're stunned in the dugout? Oh, I, I mean, he's... Yeah, I mean, he's he's been on such a good run and throwing the ball so well that, you know, even when he falls behind in the count there, he's done such a good job all year of working himself back in and finishing guys off. And, and tonight, um, he, you know, just wasn't putting guys away like he normally does. And, you know, two lefties clipped him. So um, tough one for him, but, you know, one in a long line of some some real dominance. He's principally been an eighth inning guy. What was it about the matchups that you prefer to go Britain eighth, Batances ninth? Well, I just think right now it's, you know, as, as we continue to kind of build up um, Britain, um, we'll kind of flip those those matchups and, and who actually gets the ninth inning. That'll be kind of a fluid situation. But the way Dellen's been throwing right now, he, we just feel like he's in such a good place. You know, top of the order coming up there. We like that uh, matchup with where Dellen's out right now. It looked like Dellen, I know he's had this issue throughout the season, was sort of looking at his finger. And, yeah. and was was everything all right? Did he have a blister? Did something pop there? Yeah, he, he every now and then he'll 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 cut when he's, when he's throwing his breaking ball, he'll get a little cut on his finger. I don't know if it was an issue for him tonight. Um, he didn't. When Larry went out there, he didn't. He didn't complain about her. When he came in, I have to check with him after. But it is something that happens to him every now and then. But he's usually able to work through it. You've consistently said that. Hey, I'm focusing on today's game. I'm not looking ahead. I'm not looking behind. But Detroit is a team that was last in the major leagues in homers. They they knock five out tonight. They're a team, obviously, who's really more looking towards next season, whereas you guys are still hunting for a postseason spot this season. How much more does that add to the, the deflation of losing a game like yeah, this? Yeah, I mean, this is, you know, especially as good as we play at home, you know, um, and, and I felt like uh, in the first half of the game, we did not play very well and, and you know, didn't play great behind uh, Jay, um, I thought we really had quality at bats tonight from our guys, kind of up and down, and we're able to grind back and 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 grab the lead late in the game. And then usually, you know, especially the way our back end sets up, you know, that's usually going to finish it off. But we got to play a cleaner brand of baseball too, so we're not in that situation on a night like tonight. Who else? What did you think of Jay? You know, you talked before the game about his fastball. I was able to pitch off at all three homers yeah. or off the fastball. Was it just location or? Yeah, I think so. You know, they got on, they got a, uh, they got to some high fastballs against him. You know, probably selling out on some pitches up there. I haven't seen, you know, replays to see if he got them in enough or where, where exactly he wanted to. But you know, they they definitely jumped him for some. But you know, he had to throw more pitches than he than he probably should have. You know, if if we complete some plays behind him, it makes it a little bit easier on him. And and again, that's part of that first half of the game where we just not did not play well. Joe. You mentioned the first part of the game where you didn't play well. You, there's been a lot of this recently against where it feels like maybe you're playing down to your competition a little bit. Do you feel this and do you feel that there's something that could be done to kind of rectify what's going on with your team in the field, on the bases, in a few other areas? Um, work. You know, work. We've got, you know, we've, we've got some guys moving around right now, you know, out of normal positions, um, obviously with some guys down, but it's continue to work, continue to grow, continue to get better. And, you know, we are doing that and, and we're seeing a lot of positive signs from that. But every now and then we're, we're making some mistakes that, you know, to win big, uh, we, we've got to, we've got to get better at curtailing. Another another big home run for for Luke. Is it almost getting to the point where you're gonna have to play him every day? Have you thought about what you're gonna do there? I mean, he's look, he's he's done a heck of a job and and continues to earn himself playing time and and earn at bats. And obviously, at the time, a huge hit for us tonight. Um, you know, and he's having good at bats. Um, and so, <coughs> yeah, he's gonna continue to earn playing time with with the way he's performing and the way he's. Really, the you know results are, have been there, obviously, but also I think if you look at his at bats, you know it, it's usually a competitive at bat every time. So that that I think is an encouraging sign for him even going forward. Well, yeah, well, I mean, we'll kind of see, see what we have each and every day. I mean, we, look, 
you know, we're, obviously we're a little thin right now and, you know, going with a smaller bench. So guys play, you know, and um, so there's going to be, looks like plenty of at-bats for him, especially if this continues. Jack, to the right. Aaron Stan's 300th in the losing effort. I know it becomes a little more of a footnote than a headline, but he's the fifth, or he played in the fifth fewest games to get to 300. What does that say about the career that this guy is building for himself? Yeah, I mean, I mean, I, I think everyone understands what a special talent he is. Um, and and now for us to get a up close and personal look at him and 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 the person and who he is and the way he goes about things and the way he prepares and the way um you know he cares about his craft um it's 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 a great accomplishment for him and um you know a, a, just a step along the way of what i'm sure are going to be some some even greater accompli accomplishments down the road but i'm um, happy for him to get that out of the way and um you know uh look forward to him doing a lot more too okay, thank you Aaron. yep